Hello? 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 Okay. Good morning, good morning, good morning. If you're here and if you can hear and see me, so please let me know. Confirm from your side. A very good morning. Okay, so let's begin with today's session. Good morning, everybody. I hope you will have a very nice Sunday today. So I am Bhavna Bisht. Yes, that's my photo below. And uh, this is the Telegram channel called link. If you want to be a part of it, you just have to uh, put that big link and you'll find me there. Yes. Hi, Muskan. I'm absolutely fine. How are you doing? Yes, because today is a very interesting topic that we're going to do. And that is butterflies, Himalayas and climate change. Okay, so how the climate change is affecting our butterflies, which are in the Himalayas. Okay, before we begin, let me just quickly tell you that yes we do have a mandy quiz even today with the code 3790110 so if you don't know how to do that go to any of your web browser if you don't know what a web browser is it is your chrome mozilla firefox or microsoft edge yes and as soon as you type menti.com you have to type menti.com and once you enter they'll ask for the code and this is the code you need to enter okay understood now i can only meet you every weekend at 11 a.m just here because of an academy and it is very essential to know what they have to offer us so you can get live classes for all the subjects daily from your favorite educator with weekly quizzes doubt solving sessions practice questions test series everything at your fingertips Yes, you just have to subscribe to an Academy Plus. There are already some discounts going on. And using the code BBLIVE10, you will get an additional 10% off. That is correct. So just go for it. What are you waiting for? And also, we have iconic subscription where you don't only get the benefits that I just told you, along with Creative Corner, but you also get a personal mentor. Somebody who is so experienced just for you, your doubts will be solved within 48 hours and Parent Connect and Study Planner just so that you go on the right track of cracking it. Also, as our exams are coming up, who doesn't need a daily test series? Correct, just not to check but also to boost that right amount of confidence. Yes. So what 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 else do we need now? This is my favorite site because it gives you all the information about the ongoing batches, the upcoming batches, and there's no language barrier. If you cannot understand Hindi, attend your sessions in English. And if you have to English sessions in English, then go and attend your sessions in But do not let that come in the middle of your studies. That is correct. So before we move on, just have a look in this, about this video and then we are going. What are we waiting for? 
yes just another reminder that we have a Mindy quiz you just have to go to Mindy.com and put in the code 37901110 yes okay so let's put our thinking caps on and let's crack it Ooh, chiller party let's do it so today we'll be doing butterflies Himalayas and climate change we are going to study not very much in detail but at least you should know what is happening because of the actions that the human race is doing yes so let's find out hi gadgets point hello now how many of you how many of you whenever you see butterflies in huge numbers you're like oh that's so cute that's so cute isn't that they yes so exactly so we are here to study climate change is driving butterflies moths higher up in himalayas like himalayas are not a little teeny tiny bit mountains are they no they are let's say we live in our houses on the land right we say all the butterflies have their own particular house that they live in right so what jaha originally rehte the now they are not found over there they have gone higher up in position yes and that is what we are going to study today lekin main humko ye paisa ye ye pata kai sa chala ki this something like that had happened yes so basically a new study was commissioned by the government of india yes and has found out that our average temperature even near the himalayan region has risen yes and that had made dozen of species of butterfly and moths to go higher why higher because niche to temperature rise ho gaya yes so upar wo cool cooled hoga yes and that is what is the temperature that the butterflies want and that is why they have migrated towards the upper part of the himalayas yes but ma'am who did this like who was the one jo ki itna dedicated tha that they went to the himalayas they studied the butterflies jo ek jagah rukte bhi nahi hai so that the study was funded okay because any study cannot be done for free you require some funds to carry out the whole procedure and that was given by the ministry of environment forest and climate change yes so it was funded by ministry of environment forest and climate change and the study was conducted by the zoological survey of india okay this is the logo of zoological survey of india yes so but ma'am how is it possible like uh, it can be done like main aaj gaya so mujhe pata kaise chalega like what was their early position so this tracking of insects okay it was only possible because our zoological survey of india had a very historical record of many species since the year 1865 then the records were scanned from 1865 to 2015 yes and then they compared both of the records and then they came to a conclusion yes just a reminder we have a mini quiz using the code 37901110 yes so you can be a part of it just go to mini.com and put in this code who cool. Yes, but okay, ma'am. They comparatively studied it, but kya mila? Like kya mila? What did they get out of it? So they identified at least forty-nine species of moth, seventeen species of butterfly who have started moving towards the higher altitude. Yes, and a mean, an average distance of thousand meters between the current habitat and recorded habitat matlab sub butterflies like the mean of most of the butterflies came out to be a difference of 1000 meters so pehle in around 1800s they were 1000 meter niche ab wo 1000 meter upar chale gaye hain himalaya mein yes and that is all due to the rising temperature so i'll give you one example yes so this species okay So seven species in particular have started to inhabit altitudes more than 2000 meters higher than the previous mean like most of them 
थाउजेंड मीटर से ऊपर गए थे बट सेवन स्पीशीज इन पर्टिकुलर बिकॉज इट रिक्वायर मोर थंड एटमोसफियर दे वेन टू थाउजेंड मीटर्स हाइयर देन द प्रीवियस वे दे वर फाउंड येस आई गिव यू वन एग्जाम्पल इन लद्दाख द इंडियन रेड एडमिरल बटरफ्लाई येस द बटरफ्लाई का इमेज इज योर उस हिस्टोरिकली फाउंड एट थ्री थाउजेंड नाइन हंड्रेड मीटर्स ओके एंड नाउ इट इज फाउंड एट फोर थाउजेंड एट हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी थ्री मीटर्स एंड दैट इज एन इंक्रीज ऑफ नाइन So this butterfly is the Indian Admiral butterfly. You can see over here. Yes, a scientific name is Vanessa indica. What else, ma'am? What else? Huh? The extension of the range of lep Lepidoptera butterflies in Mon due to climate change has been observed all over the world. Yes. Now these butterflies. What is a uh, Lepidoptera? So all the butterflies. Okay, when you put them under a microscope and they have scales which appear dust-like that are put under Lepidoptera. That is not just one butterfly. It's like a family of butterflies who show dust-like scales on their wings. And they are. I've given some photos over here. Yes, these are some of the examples, and these have not only changed, uh, not only mm -hmm. like shown change here, here in India, but throughout the world. Yes, the study has also identified two species which are hotspots. We have done hotspots in one of our earlier sessions last week. West Bengal's Darjeeling Hills have recorded more than five, four hundred species. Yes, and in Kumau, Uttarakhand, more than six hundred species were recorded. Himachal Pradesh also showed two high diversity regions, and they were Dharmshala and Shimla. The studies also revealed the increase in the richness of Lepidoptera. I mean, the numbers have increased. Yes, so biodiversity from western to eastern Himalayas. So earlier, so it is found that two hundred eleven. species of butterfly are found in the west and 354 species of butterflies are found in the east him eastern himalayas yes so ooh, 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 hello everybody a very good morning so i hope you're having a good sunday because to make it more good we have a mendy quiz with the code 37901110 so do not wait for a long time Just go for it. Hi, Shivam Kumar. Hello. We'll be having Menti in next five minutes, so stay tuned. Okay. But ma'am, like, what? Why? Why did they move upwards? Yeah. I mean, like, why? Yes. The very first reason is receding glaciers. As we all know, there are a ton of glaciers in the Himalayan range, right? So the ice caps and glaciers in Himalayas are receding. Why? Leading to scarcity of water in the Himalayas, and that is a major reason of altitudinal shift of Lepidoptera. Next is rise in temperature. Rise in temperature has resulted in altitudinal shift in vegetation. Yes, abhi just imagine if the Himalayan niche, jab wahan pe there used to be so much coal that wahan pe pedi nahi ukte the. Yeah, at this region, just imagine ped hi nahi ukte the. But now, due to increasing temperature, yes, that has pro provided a very good environment for from shrubs, plants, and little herbs to grow. Yes, and that is why also because vegetation change हो गया ये vegetation की उनको आदत नहीं थी. Like if you are a vegetarian and if I give you chicken to eat, would you like it? No, similarly, this vegetation is very particular to the butterflies, the insects, and the animals that live there. Yes, and now the vegetation has changed, so they are moving up higher in the mountains. Understood? Hi, Shiva Mishra. Hello. And the next one is human habitation, because who doesn't know that Darjeeling, Shimla, are such a big tourist spot. Right, so although there is too much rich biodiversity of butterfly over there, but we are going in their territory. We are disturbing their territory, and that is why the space for butterfly has shrunk. मतलब तुम्हारा घर है, okay? We live in our houses. 
बट कल के दिन अगर दो चार लोग आ गए हु यू डोंट नो हु आर लिविंग इन योर स्पेस एंड यू कैंट इवन डू एनीथिंग अबाउट इट सो योर स्पेस इज कॉम्प्रोमाइज यस सिमिलर थिंग इज हैपन टू हैपनिंग टू द बटरफ्लाईज सो वी आर गोइंग टू अस अ मेंटी क्वेस इन नेक्स्ट टू मिनट्स सो प्लीज पुट इन द कोड 3790110 ओके But ma'am, like okay, fine. Butterflies. We thought butterflies only look cute and ऐसे उड़ते रहते हैं. उनका क्या ही importance होगा? Why are we studying this? So let me tell you. Butterflies and moths are indicators of healthy environment and healthy ecosystems. Yes, they collectively provide a range of ecosystem services like pollination and natural pest control. Yes. Pollination से who is not aware because butterflies go for nectar. Yes, जब वो जा ही रहे हैं तो थोड़ा pollen भी लग जाता है उनकी body में. Yes, and as they are going from one flower to another, they are transferring the pollens and leading to fertilization. Yes. Ah, uh, yes, Hafiz Ali, this class is absolutely free. Hi, technical mafia. Hello. Hi, Ria. Now they are also a very important element in the food chain and are a prey for birds, bats, and other insectivorous animals. Yes, and hence they play a very critical role in increasing species diversity in an ecosystem. Or the species diversity when we have amazing, amazing, amazing diversity of a particular species. A uh, butterfly has been widely used by ecologists as a model organism to study the impact of habitat loss. fragmentation and climate change yes because uh, studying that in bigger animals like unko asar dheere dheere padega but these little 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 organisms are perfect model to understand ki how climate change is affecting all of us and even them yes so these are some of the ecological importance of butterflies and moths and before you say anything else let's move on to menti We are going towards Menti Quiz. Yes, this is the official An Academy YouTube channel. Please go to Menti dot com. Go to Menti dot com. आप ने Google पे जा सकते हैं. You can go to any web browser, Mozilla Firefox, Microsoft Edge. Just put in Menti dot com. वहाँ पे एक box आएगा जहाँ पे वो आपको code पूछेंगे और आपको code डालना है three seven nine zero double one zero. Okay. Are you there yet? Are we there yet? Put the code three seven nine zero double one zero. It is also displayed on the screen. You there? You can answer in the live chat session section. Hmm. Hafiz, yes, you have to go to menti dot com. Put in the code three seven nine zero double one zero. Okay anybody else remaining or should we start If you're not there yet I'm waiting for one last minute the code is 3790110 Hi Santa hi rose hi buddy hi king oh crocodile a magician's hat is who do we have over here very nice anybody else remaining भारत का इरादा इरादा कर लिया हमने ओके एवरीबॉडी इन द YouTube लाइव चैट सेशन आई होप यू हैव जॉइंड द मेंटी क्विज यस बिकॉज़ वी हैव अ मेंटी क्विज यू हैव टू पुट इन द कोड 3790110 
Okay. The first question is coming up. This is the logo of. You don't even have to apply a lot of logic because it's quite simple. 15 seconds to go. This is the logo of. If anybody is new in the YouTube, please know that you can join us on menti.com. Absolutely correct. ZSI, that is Zoological Survey of India. And I don't know if you saw the image properly or not. Zoological Survey of India. So it was easy peasy. Wasn't it? Let's see the leaderboard. Oh, oh, hi, Agancha. Hi, 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 hi. All the regulars are here. Let's see. So we have Agancha, Bhojdas, Class 4, Barbie doll, Muskan, and Janvi. Janvi ne kata nahi khola hai, but I'm damn sure she will. And the fastest answer to this question was given to us by the one and only Akansha. Next question. Absolutely right, Muskan. Are we ready for the next one? So go. Records from Dash to 2015 were scanned and examined to make a competitive assessment. Yes, you cannot uh, just lightly say that you are so okay. Because if you have butterflies 1000 meters up, you need matters to study that information. Yes. Oh my god, you were paying so much attention to the class. Proud of you. Very good. Hello, if anybody is new to the YouTube live chat session, you have you can join us on menti.com using the code 37901110. Yes. Let's see the little boat. Oi hoi, oi hoi, oi hoi. Kikardi. Oh my god. So we have a good show. Bush does class 4. Barbie, Muskan, and Janvi. All of you have given us the right answer. And Barbie has given us the fastest answer. Congratulations, Barbie. Yes. Let's move on to the next question. The code is 37901010. The Indian Red Admiral Butterfly have shown an altitudinal increase of. Woohoo! 1,000 meters is the mean of what all the species have shown, leaving seven species who have shown an increase of 2,000 meters. But Indian Red Admiral Butterfly has shown the altitudinal increase of 950 meters. Amazing, yeah? Let's see the leaderboard. Okay. So, wow, the leaderboard doesn't change. We have Akansha, Bojdas, Class 4, Barbie, Muskan Singh, and Janvi. And the fastest answer, once again, is given to us by the one and only Akansha. Congratulations, dear. Next question. The second last question for today. I hope you're there. Let's get moving. Look at your mobile screens to get the maximum answer. So this is a multiple choice question where you can select more than one option. Mark all the factors causing their upward movement. You don't only have to mark one, but you have to mark all of it. And I think you just marked one, did not you? Yes, a ban of PUBG. Kaise? So receding glaciers, rising temperature, human habitation are all the causes. A, B, C, Tino B causes hai for the upward movement of butterflies. Yes. 
let's look at the leaderboard. Nice. Uh oh. So we have a good job. Barbie, Bosch Das Class 4, Muskan Singh, Janvi. Amazing, guys. And the fastest answer once again is given to us by the one and only Akansha. Congratulations, dear. And the last question for today coming up on the screen. Are you ready? So go. Which butterfly is this? Oh, what do you think? Do you know? Do you know? Morning cloak butterfly, black admiral moth, small skipper, Indian red admiral. Woohoo! Three of you have given me the absolute right answer. It is the one and only Indian red admiral. I even showed it to you on the slide. So you guys were paying attention. Nice. Let's see the last leaderboard for today. Uh oh, oh, oh. What do you think? Is it going to change? No. So we have Akansha, the winner again for this Menti quiz. And we then followed by runner-up Barbie, followed by Voj Das, Muskan, and Janvi. Congratulations, Akansha. Congratulations, Barbie, because she has given us the fastest answer to this question. Yes, Galbata. Everybody, thank you so much for participating. Congratulations, Akansha, once again. And do not go anywhere because I'm giving you a very exciting homework. And the homework is... Learn scientific names of butterflies in your surroundings because you never know, okay? You are just sitting on your window seal and Achanak Sisama says there's a cute butterfly that comes. It, it, it has amazing orange, yellow stripes, right? So just describe the butterfly. Go on Google and try to find out scientific names. Or just go on Google and try to be like common butterfly seen in this state. Yeah, the, like the state where you reside. Yes, and they will give you all the common butterflies, the scientific names. So you can be like, ah, many butterfly ko dekha tha. Yes, so try and do that and it will be fun. Let me tell, let me tell you that. And also, if you are planning on coming to an Academy Plus, you can use the referral code BBLI10, which will give you an extra 10% discount. Yes. So congratulations, Akansha, once again. Yes. And if you have any doubts, please let me know in the comment section. Otherwise, I hope you have a happy Sunday. Any doubts? I'm waiting for 30 seconds over here. Okay. Okay, guys, this is it for today's session. Do not forget to share this video with your friends so they can also learn something new. And give this video a big fat thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell icon so you're notified whenever I come live. Yes, and all the other dedicators. So I'll see you next time. Till then, bye. And if you are CBSE class 9, today we have a special class at 1 p.m. and 3 p.m. Okay, on physics, CBSE class 9, motion and force and laws of motion. So I'll see you then. Bye-bye. Oh,